Hi, and welcome to the Earth Institute's animated learning series, where we take research topics and projects we work on and explain them simply. This episode is titled Carbon Capture, Sequestration, and Reuse, The Basics. First things first, climate change is largely due to carbon dioxide. But why? Because we burn lots of natural gases and coal in power plants. And gasoline in cars. The emissions then go into the atmosphere and stay there, heating the planet. So, what can we do about it? One solution is to use energy sources like solar, wind, and possibly nuclear, and use them more efficiently. But with the United Nations projecting 9 billion people in 2050, 2.2 billion more than today, and a predominance of coal resources worldwide, we can't ignore that fossil fuels are going to continue to be used. So what else can we do? Well, here's where carbon capture, sequestration, and CO2 reuse come in. But what is that stuff? And more importantly, how do we do it? In this webisode series, we will learn about some of the methods to capture, store, and reuse CO2 that we work on at the Earth Institute. You ready? First, we've got carbon capture. And we are learning how to do it in one of two ways. We are learning to either capture it from the air, or directly from inside the power plant. Next, we've got carbon sequestration, which is the act of safely storing carbon away from the atmosphere. What we just saw is called geologic sequestration. Similarly, there's sub-seafloor sequestration. Oh, lots of S's in that one. There's even something called rock sequestration. And I assure you, it's like nothing else you've ever seen before. Most of this CO2 will have to be stored. But some of it will be able to be reused successfully. One possible reuse is paper filler. Another is house building materials. And even something called solar gasoline. So tune in next time to learn about the different types of carbon capture the Earth Institute is researching in our amazing synthetic tree project. We'll also show you how we plan to transform a dirty power plant into an Earth-friendly one. See you next time!